it is Manchester United nil, Arsenal one. Manchester United losing against Arsenal. Arsenal k- taking a step forward to winning the league one game down to the final game of the season. Where well, I thought today Manchester United got a lot key. Arsenal allowed us. You know what? Arsenal were playing in second gear, you know. A game where you thought Manchester United was going to get their ass whooped, served. Never happened, but these players, these Manchester United players, I watched that game. 19 minutes of horrible football. 19 minutes of, please turn this shit off. Horrible, another 19 minutes of, can you end the season now? Like, end the stream, Robbie. End everything, bruv. We have had enough. This team is shambolic. Eric Ten Hag, the management, the team, everything about this is just tells us it's just shit. It was a shit Sunday, shit afternoon for us to see our team lose against Arsenal 1-0, which we was lucky. Arsenal can, I repeat, sitting in uh, playing in second gear where we was lucky to even, even lose like this because we should have lost even worse than it, it. A lot of players let me down. Ali Hunter Gonacho today has proven to me that when, it, when the onus is on him to make changes, um, have the effect take on players, beat players. He just shows us that he's not. He's too greedy. He goes for the glory. He's not creative enough. He doesn't create opportunities. And that just tells me we cannot hang our hopes on him next season. We need to buy a player that will take put him on the bench and make him realise that he needs to be a, a foot forward that can assist and contribute to games as well. Ahmed Diallo came on, started the game today, ended up injured. Of course he was born in a bit shelling, but it just tells me we cannot rely on these players. It's a reason why you haven't really been starting. And it's another reason why I have to say, sell the goddamn players because they've been awful. Let's look at the game overall because it was another disappointing game. I'm tired of seeing my team unable to play football. My manager told me he wants us to be the best at transitional football. What the sh- worst was the worst at transitional football. So shit at transitional football. Counter-attacking does not exist. We do not understand what counter-attacking for is because we can't do it. We've had an opportunity several times for transition and counter-attack. Look how horrible we looked. Manchester United letting us down. First 45 minutes, I thought we was rubbish. You know, We did not create at all. Raya had a nice time in goal. Let's be real. Until Manchester United conceded the first goal. The ball being to pass from, from, from deep, from I believe that was Ben White, all the way to Havertz, leaving so much space for Havertz to just have his time to go run into the box of Manchester United, to cut it in, for Trossard to just tap it in. And Casemiro, nowhere to be found in that situation, just not thinking, not concentrating. And that's whoa, Aaron Wambisaka being found out. Half time. 1-0 to Arsenal, 1-0 to the Gunners, 1-0 to the Arsenal, as they always say. Manchester United going to that second half. They had played another atrocious football. We are so shit. Manchester United proving themselves that they are unable to do nothing. Not testing the goalkeeper of Arsenal. Not creating anything in that second half. Not creating one zilch of chances, no one-on-ones. It's boring, bro. Manchester United, you get to get away with it again, like because we should have got battered. That's what I mean. We've got away with it. We should have got battered by Arsenal. Arsenal took it easy not on us. They're like, hi, you know what? You're a little brother. We're going to sun you. We're going to take care of you. We're not going to embarrass you. We're going to win this game, but we're not going to embarrass you in front of everyone so they can troll on us. Troll on you guys. They did us a favour. They saved us from getting trolled on. Another game today. Another disappointment. I can't wait to, for the season to end. I, I'm tired of watching this team. This team is so dead. It kills me to do watch-alongs, guys. Anyway, Matt, today, let's look at the players today. Amrabat, I, I think the second half, he was our best player. Winning the ball back. Trying to drive forward as well. Alejandro Gonacho had a poor game. Unable to beat his man. He can't beat his man. No diddy, but he can't beat his man. Ahmed, bored, then got injured. Sell him. Sell him. Casemiro was a joke today. He looks unfit. I can't say much about this guy. It's just, what do you expect? Playing out of position. It was Arsenal. He's true. It just showed. Really, truly just showed. It's been another poor game. Man of the match today, have to go to no one. 
But don't kill the match. Casemiro and Alejandro Ganacho. You guys let me know what your thoughts on today's game. Let me know who your man the match is. Don't give the match as well in the comments section. Because it's just another poor game. I'm just tired. I just want it to end. I want the season to end. We're back live 8 p.m. for the catch up with the man them to dis dissect this match in full, even though we don't really want to. Remember to subscribe to Red United TV, smash that like button, share across all social media platforms, and become a member. And uh, last but not least, remember to keep it united. As much as we can. Remember to keep it Red United. Your boy is out. Peace and sayonara. Oh, so subscribe.